to the channel, y'all. Here's another great product for you guys that I picked up from Dollar Tree, and I said I'd share it with you guys. Um, actually, um, it's called, um, pretty much a lot of y'all heard of this, um, it's Dollar Tree Cleaning Vinegar. Alright, now I read y'all still can get this out of Dollar Tree now, um, had my bottle for a while here, and, uh, actually, um, it said kill bacteria and it kill germs, I, um, I know it's for cleaning, and I seen, it said the vinegar, the, the cleaning vinegar, you can use this on the interior of your car, your door handles, your door knobs, your steering wheel, uh, whatever, uh, your door, where you close your door with and open your door with um, cleaning vinegar. They say cleaning vinegar actually uh, cleans and sanitizes and cure germs, you know. So, um, just throwing out some tips out there because I, I went to the stores and the stores ain't got no um, disinfect sprays in there hardly no more. I mean, they like gone. <laughs> the disinfect sprays is gone. The bathroom paper is gone. That paper towel is gone. And um, luckily, I got a lot of bathroom paper. I just keep that on hand a lot. So I got about 12, 15 rolls. So pretty much I'm all right. But that's just something I keep all the time, you know. So I never really run out of bathroom paper. So, uh, yeah. But went in the store. Bathroom paper was dry. <laughs> paper towel was dry. Um hand sanitizer is dry um what a disinfect spray is dry and alcohol wipes and not yeah dry and um i think the clorox wipes and stuff is dry now what you probably other other than cleaning vinegar like i got here what you probably can do is um take your about a little clorox uh, maybe a top full, uh, two top fools, and put it to like a gallon of water or something like that, and that'll give you know, a little bit of soap, and that'll probably do some disinfectant. Clorox kill all germs. You could take a little Clorox and mix it with a little water and some, a couple drops of dish detergent, and basically do about the same thing outside of cleaning vinegar. But cleaning vinegar, you can just simply put this in a spray bottle. And just spray it on the door handle, you know, your steering wheel area, uh, whatever. You know, mainly the stuff that you're going to touch with your hands. Because you can wash your hands, but you still want to sanitize and kind of clean your door handle area and your steering wheel area of your vehicle. Never know when the stuff could be settling down out of the air or whatever, you know. So, um, because they said don't touch your face, uh, your mouth, your eyes, you know. So that's the key, is try to clean all those areas. Uh, the reason why, like I made it the video earlier about the totally awesome, the, the key was if you probably can clean those areas. No, it's got to remove the virus if it cleans the area, because that's why they say, you know, I'm going to sit this down. That's why they said wash your hands. No, wash your hands. So if you clean the area, with disinfect sprays like this, for example, it's the same thing. It's like you're washing your hands. Clean your door handles. Clean your steering wheel. You know, clean the way you close the door wheel. Just wipe off things in your vehicle. You know, because, um, you know, your vehicle is exposed to the air a lot. I and mean, you never know what's selling down on the door handle when you open the door to get in the car. You know. So you want to kind of wipe those down. And I feel like disinfect spray, not disinfect spray, but all-purpose clean, uh, clean, uh, clean whatever's on that door handle off. You know, steering wheel. All-purpose cleaners are clean whatever's on that steering wheel off. That's what I think anyway. Whether it's the flu virus, uh, coronavirus, SARS, <laughs> a pneumonia, uh, whatever, have an iron party. And get rid of all of them. Mm -hmm. Alright. And um. Yeah. I mean. Uh, Cause. These viruses has been around. COVID-19 ain't a new virus. If you look on the back of the Lysol can. 
it's been stated that the Lysol disinfect spray kills COVID-19 coronavirus. It's right on the can. And I'm pretty sure it didn't just get up there. So this virus been around for ages, you know. Read the back of If you guys have Lysol can, read the back of your Lysol can. I got one. I can share it with you guys. It's up there. It kills that. So pretty much, all purpose cleaners are killing. It once you wipe, it remove blood stains, tar, and all that stuff. Once you wipe them, that's why they said clean your hands. See, once you clean a surface with an all-purpose cleaner, it cleans away all the germs. That's the purpose of cleaning it. So that's why I, that reflects back to the video that I did earlier. That's the per. That's why they said wash your hands, wash your areas, clean stuff, clean your door handles. Clean your steering wheel. In your house, clean your doorknobs off. So, I reflect back to this. These are all-purpose cleaners. No, because I had a smart comment to my, it doesn't disinfect anything. And it still cleans it. Just like, clean your hands. They recommend you wash your hands then using sanitizers. You know, so they said the best thing for is to wash your hands. So, I'm saying use all-purpose cleaners and clean your door panels and all this stuff off. Because, for one, you can't get disinfect sprays no more. The stores run down. You know, you can't get hand sanitizers. The stores is run down. So, you got to think outside the box. Just got to be clean. Wash your hands. Clean your car up. Wash your door handles. Clean your door panels. Clean your steering wheel. So, for anybody to make those smart comments and stuff like that, it's the same thing. They said, wash your hands. Well, clean your car. Clean your steering wheel. Clean your door panels. What's the difference in washing your hands? Makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> All right? So, if you clean your car, that's just like washing your hands. What's the difference? Anyway, till next time. Y'all pick up that cleaning vinegar. I'm out of here. Peace.